Hey guys, it's Julia, and today I have an unboxing for you guys. I am super excited about this unboxing. This was sent to me by the owner of Lit Love Shop, and this is one of her grab boxes, and I'm so super excited to open this because it's amazing. I think it's basically kind of like a mystery box where she, she kind of like mixes things from her shop into it as like in one box. I kind of peeked into it a little bit and was really, really impressed by just the few things that I saw. So I'm really excited to show you guys what's in here. Okay, so I will have everything that you need to know about this box linked down below, including price and where you can grab one of these boxes and the um, channel for uh, Nikki Culver because she is the owner of the shop and I'll have her YouTube channel linked down below because uh, she's a, a sweet little peach. Okay, so the first thing I see in here is a shirt. <laughs> We're gonna open it up. How cute. I can already tell it's cute. The color is like, ooh. This is a Bella and Canvas shirt, so it is very good quality. I love Bella and Canvas shirts. They're always impressive. Okay, so this one says, woo, bookish vibes only. How cute. And it's like spring print. It smells like vinegar. I don't know why. So cute. I can't wait to wear this. Put that open there. Okay, next thing. Ooh, uh, is this a mouse pad? This is cute. I think this is a mouse pad. Coffee and sass. It is, it's a mouse pad. Enjoy an exclusive discount just for Lit Love Box subscribers. Use code, that's for me. Okay, um, how cool is that? That's super cool, it's a mouse pad. I'm gonna have to get like an actual like mouse now just so that I can use that because I don't actually have a mouse. So I just have a laptop. Okay, next is another shirt. What, guys, I love shirts. And I don't have a lot of book of shirts, which is weird, but. Okay, so this one is blue and it is that good quality again. And it says, greater than these bones. Freaking cute. Look at that color of shirt. I love these colors. Okay, next I see a bookmark. It looks like it's the Cruel Prince bookmark. I love these magnetic bookmarks and I have beans on my finger. Why? So cute! And I love the cruel prints, so I am in love with that. Next, we have some tea. The Simply Bookish Co. Rowan Tea from the Throne of Glass. And the ingredients are black tea and oolong, peppermint, lemongrass, and spearmint. If you know me, you know I love tea. It's, it's my shit. So I am excited to drink that. And then we have little ponytail holders. Guys, this box has so much stuff in it. I'm not even halfway through what I got in here. So <laughs> hold on to your britches because it's going to be a long ride. This is from Manatee Gifts and there's a Etsy shop. This is so cute. These are so cute. I love this little fox one. Guys, I love foxes as you can probably tell. So I'm really excited about this. Next is You Cruel Wicked Thing bookmark, which is I believe the Cruel Prince as well. It's in this cute little nice plastic wrap. Ooh. 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 And it is a nice thick laminated bookmark. Good quality bookmark. Girl, this box. This, this box is everything. Okay. Ooh, and then there's a Cruel Prince print. Freaking stunning print, which I'm gonna put on my wall over there because I've started actually hanging up all of my prints because now I actually have like a library and I want it to, I want to do something with my prints. I never do anything with them. There's another bookmark in here that is a Lit Love Shop bookmark that says for the lit lover in you. But you're welcome. Okay, next we have a Lady of Parent, per, parent, I don't know. You know what I'm, what I'm trying to say. It is a, oh, this is a regular wick. Mmm, smells so good. Fresh berry and vanilla. And these, all of these candles in here are, <coughs> <coughs> are from Lit Love Shop. She makes these and they're wonderful. They smell really good. Okay. The next one is High Lord of Spring, Perithian Honeysuckle and Anger Issues. <laughs> That's cute. Woo, that one's strong. And this one, it has a wood wick, which I'm super excited about. I don't have any wood wick candles, guys. I don't have any, any of them. And I think they're wonderful, so. 
Next is Mother of Dragons, Dragons, Blood, Smoke, and Ruin, which is flippin' sweet because, guys, um, I just started getting destined to watch the Game of Thrones, so we started it over, and I haven't even gotten caught up yet. I'm only on season five, so I'm like, so now we started it over, so now I'm, I'm, I'm like, really loving it. I'm really loving it, and um, we're gonna watch it all the way through, and then we're gonna get caught up with the new one. So, we're really excited. I'm excited to have this candle because, um, yeah, it smells so freaking good. So good. Okay, the next one is Crotion Queen, Dragon's Blood and Hearts of Men. And this one is a Woodwick candle as well. Mm, that one smells really good. Really, 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 really good. Add those to my other candles. Okay. Oh, there's another. Ooh, there's a Jude bookmark too. Ah, oh, so cute. So cute. I love these bookmarks, guys. I can never get enough of these. They're adorable. Okay, so I think there are two books in here. The first one is Heyman's. The former royal bloodline of Russia thought to be lost forever has resurfaced and newly found descendants have been embraced and issued honor, honor, honorary titles. Unbeknownst to the rest of the world, they bring with them a powerful addiction that will change the country forever. I think that this is a self-published book, which is super cool that she includes self-published books. Um, the cover is really, really pretty. And so I'm excited to read the rest of the back of it. Ooh, there's something in here. There's a print. Ooh, the princess is awake. So are her demons. Ah. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Sounds real good. Okay. And the last thing in the box is A Touch of Gold by Annie Silva. So Sullivan, so Sullivan, Sullivan. Sullivan spins an engaging tale of insidious curses and abandoned gifts. A touch of gold is a thoughtful addition to the myth of King Medeus, told through his daughter Cora's perspective. I dare say it should have been Cora's story all along. Ooh, gold is wealth, wealth is power, and power is a curse. That sounds good. That sounds really good. I'm excited about that. I'm, I'm digging it. I'm digging it. Okay, guys, so that is it for this unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like, and don't forget to subscribe if you're new here. You know, subscribe down below. And that is really it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to check out Lit, Lit Love Shop. Um, the owner of the shop is incredibly amazing, and I loved everything I got in this box, so why not go check it out? Um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!